Hello, my name is Masati and I teach life orientation. Thank you so much for clicking the video. So today we're going to be talking about change. Change in different circumstances, not just change, okay? Because we realize that you don't only experience change in school or post-school. It's not always about change. is not always concerning school, right? It concerns a lot of things. You've been experiencing pain. Sorry, <laughs> you've been experiencing um, change. Um, from 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 liking the color red to liking the color purple from from liking this kind of a friends to this kind of a friends okay so we've been like for, for, from from wearing size seven to size um to size eight so we've been experiencing pain before uh, why why am i saying pain maybe i'm in pain Shem. yo maybe I, Mara, I am in pain i'm so tired but let's get um let's get into it um and then you why, why, why are we learning about change what is the importance of this chapter why is this chapter in our curriculum is because we realize that change is an ongoing process we've realized that learning about it right learning about change it improves the quality of our lives because now that we know that oh the reason why it's because i've changed into this right so now you can able to ease up right hands are rolled in the last point or change it helps to ease up our life okay okay so let's continue to um how to adopt to change how to adopt to change so change basically if you want to really um uh, be okay in this life right you want to be okay in this life and you want to uh, cope you want to be the same person or you want to be able to uh, change from different circumstances to another you really need to accept acceptance is the key to happiness i'm pretty sure you know about that so you need to accept the change so if ever maybe you don't longer like your certain friends and you like this type of a friend it's okay for as long as you accept that okay you know what maybe i've changed to liking this kind of a friends now because i've realized that oh now i'm doing my trick i need to really be with friends who are focusing on their schools you really need to accept that change or okay oh change is okay right and then you really write down what you enjoy about the change so now that you've changed those bad friends now that you, you're with a friend obviously they're going to teach you how to study always the <clears throat> With you, you know, about school stuff, studying, library, and all that, and all that, and all that. Obviously, you're going to be what getting higher marks, right? These are the things that you need to write down. You write down what you enjoy about that change, okay? And then you don't focus on to me. Jela tawda last year, who's gonna be telling you? Oh well, now that you're doing my trick, or you no longer want to be our friends. Blah, 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 blah. Now you focus on this, on the good part about it. What pass? And now you understand. You're able to consult to your teachers. You're able to study on your own. You're able to study until night. You're able to 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 see your results you're able to get 60 marks instead of the 20s that you used to get last year right those are the good things and you really need to focus on them you don't um <coughs> you need to stop being stubborn if you really want to deal with change and adapt with change you really need to stop being stubborn stop being to accept the change and stop being stubborn stop being like well that well i like the color red i've been liking the color red since i was young and then it's been my color from day one now that the color white is the in thing and you feel like yo you know what this is the color for me now i'm no longer doing the color red before it's uh, anymore it's fine stop being stubborn stop trying to change stop trying trying to stay in one position you're not meant to stay in one position unless otherwise okay you've not been staying in one position of born a baby and now you're probably a teenager or probably a preteen or whatever that you are or whatever position that you are right now so it shows where you shouldn't be staying in one position so stop being stubborn change if you want to change if you feel like you know what i no longer want to be a certain person it's okay you can change okay stop being stubborn stop putting yourself under pressure Allah's change and it's okay don't compare okay don't compare where it's not unnecessary don't compare where it's not necessary if you feel like sorry um sorry sorry 
don't compare where it's not necessary don't be comparing your new friends with your old friends don't be comparing or comparing your new relationship with your old relationships okay people are not the same except that you've moved on from the old person to the new person now okay so you need to be going with the new person stop being stop comparing and talking about well if i was with my friends now we could be doing this well we could be saying this well you could be saying this we could be doing this stop comparing you've changed your old friends to your new friends you really need to enjoy and live up to your new friends okay or, or your new relationships and then think of how you adapt to previous change so you really need to be um just in case um thinking of how you adapt to previous change obviously like i said obviously way before you have been um been changing okay so the term changing the word change is not a new term for you so you've been changing before from grade r to grade one from grade one to grade three obviously you've been experiencing challenges new topics new friends new table new environment new classroom new this new there okay and then your body somehow land on how you're going to be able to adapt to that so you use those strategies use those right they're still important use those strategies on how you're going to on how you use to adapt to that chain and then the other one is listen to motivational quotes and speakers this one i usually do it i do listen to motivational quotes not really motivational speakers because you know them I, motivational speakers um, they'll be telling you are oh, you gonna be a lion dream like a lion be a lion like i, I don't do that but but if we're not motivated motivational speakers it's okay do listen to them if you want to okay i, I listen to motivational quotes some on youtube um some on um in books but i don't really really but if if they are in a book i do i do read but i won't be buying a book just to to read a motivational quote but if it's there i do you know i do read it and i do take it seriously plan what to do okay plan what to do since while well, you're going to be probably some of you are listening to this because they are university some of you are high school some of you are going to into a new environment please do plan on what to do on that particular day or on that particular night on or on that particular morning this is going to be helping you because planning is important okay if, even though it won't be according to the uh, to the plan it's okay it's okay you don't need to uh to to um to pressure yourself as long as you have something that you wrote down okay and then you have to be uh positive just because it doesn't mean over left out it doesn't mean you're going to be different from other people or just because um it doesn't mean um it's a different human being Big. this is south africa everyone is south african okay just because global most south africa were international doesn't mean you're going to be less of a human being or less of a man or less of a human or less of a child okay people sorry be positive always be positive they're going to welcome you they're going to be you're going to find good people even though bad people will be there but then you're going to be finding good people okay so just take it seriously it's just um a different environment be positive everything will be nice everything will be fine and then try to blend in okay try to blend in so if maybe you um you are from a vendor you grew up speaking vendor and then you go to university of limpopo where everyone is speaking spending try to blend in okay try to be try using their slangs try greeting them in their language try talking their language try you know try or try eating their food this makes you blending in don't be stubborn don't be like oh well i'm from vendor oh we don't eat this oh we don't say this oh we don't go this oh we don't do that try blending it do what other people are doing you remember the saying if you can beat them join them right so this saying this really really just sums up that saying blending in blend in eat their food sing what they sing dance with what they sing greet them use their slangs laugh with them and all that and make friends with them okay um the last one um uh the last uh, chapter that i just included is um a lifestyle plan this doesn't really 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 have much to do and also i don't have much to say about it all i all i'm uh, i gotta say about it even it's it's in my conclusion all i have to say about it is a lifestyle plan is we saying to you that you plan what you want to do in life you plan a set in life and it doesn't matter what you're experiencing in life i know some of you will be like oh well i didn't go up with milk i didn't go up with water so why would the award expect me to succeed in life i didn't grow up with this i don't have money i don't have clothes i didn't have this i didn't have that why am i expected to do this 
since the thing is at the end of the day in this life once you are once you are 26 everyone is expecting you to do what 26 year old are doing in this world it doesn't matter you grew up without a tv or a milk okay so you really need to plan your lifestyle okay with all the challenges that you have in this life and don't focus on your challenges they they they, they are there to make you good okay they are there to test you and it doesn't mean that they're not there to stop your journey or all that okay so all i'm uh, all I, I gotta say for this lesson is that we need to accept change we need to adapt to that change and we don't need to be negative about it. Change is there to make us do good, okay? So thank you so much for clicking this video. I'm really tired. Thank you, thank you. Please do like, please do subscribe. Bye-bye.